I just came back from watching the Rich movie, and that movie it was a D grade, it was a disappointing um, Disney movie. Um, I just suggest you to wait for pay per view to save your money, unless the kids want to go see it and they're bugging to go see it. So you're gonna have an island that this sorcerer um, lives on the island. He's married and he's a king, and Ash, this young girl, is gonna become his apprentice. So she goes up into the castle and he reveals to her um, the wishes and he shows her up in the ceiling these all these wishes and these globes that he's been withholding from people from not giving them their wishes, even though they come to see him and ask for it. And eventually she'll be dissatisfied and she's gonna leave the castle and go out in the woods and um, a star is gonna come down and this little magical looking star Orange looking things gonna start giving like, pixie dust to the animals and her pet lamb. They're gonna start talking. And then she's gonna figure out, like, hey, with this star here, we can go back and get all these wishes in the and these um glass globes, take them out and give them to the people who want their desires to be met. So it's a lot of singing. Um the animation style is different from the like the digital ones that they've had in the past on Disney movies. So it looks like a like a animation style, more of a computer generated style. So, um, just wait for pay-per-view and save that money. <laughs> All right, that's my review. Y'all have a good night.